As you go through Lightroom, there are several occasions where you might want the modules to work a bit better for you. So here are a few tips to switch up the panels to work for your needs. If you want to get rid of the clutter in Lightroom, then you can quickly and easily do this in a couple of different ways, with a couple of different effects. The first option is to get rid of all of the panels from your screen. This is pretty useful when you're in something like survey mode and need a bit more screen real estate. To do this, just tap the tab key and you're all set. This minimizes those surrounding panels, giving you a bigger viewing area for your images. The second option is called lights out, and you can do this by tapping the L key. Hit it once and it darkens the background, giving you a good view of the image you're working on. Tap it again and the background blacks out completely. You can control how dark each step is too by going to preferences, then interface, then change the two drop downs that are under the lights out bar. Another good thing to look at with the side panels is the size of them. If your monitor is a decent size, then make use of it. Drag those side panels out, especially in the develop module. These larger sized sliders will really allow you to be more precise with your edits. As you're going through your edited images, you might want to take a closer look at some of the effects that you've done through the different panels to see which panels have had what effect. A quick and easy way to do this is to go through the panels on the right and hit the little light switches. These turn the panel or effect off and on, allowing you to see what the image looks like with or without the individual effect. I do hope these tips have been useful. For more tips on Lightroom, do make sure you check out the rest of the series with Wex Photo Video.